hate clutter on my worktops and I need plenty of storage. Can you show me some of your storage solutions and what they can do? Well, there's a couple of options on storage. There's hidden and there's more individual. And it's best to plan these up front with your designer. These deep wide drawers are perfect for pots and pans. And this generous curved glazed wall unit is ideal for storing items on display. This pull-out is ideal for storing a variety of items. Mm, I like the way it glides all the way out for easy access. This larder holds lots of shopping. Everything comes to you and it's easy to plan into any kitchen. Clever use of lighting too. Recycling is important to a lot of us. Yes, and our bins with a separate compartment make recycling really easy. These undermounted sinks are easy to wipe things into and keep clean. Mm. And this stylish tap looks ideal for washing vegetables. I have an awkward corner in my kitchen. How can I make the most of it? Well, the Magic Corner or Lamon are a great way to maximise storage in corners with easy access to all items. This kitchen is far more traditional than the last one and I love this pantry. Is this the only option? No, the design's completely flexible and your second nature designer should be able to help you pick out the features that you really like. Whether it's this carousel, small chopping board or spice rack. I love all the features. Can we look at some other storage features in this kitchen? This curved timber pan drawer provides storage with style. And a great finishing touch is the pewter handle. Here's a good example of individual storage. Perfect for your favourite tipple. Where would I store all my cleaning products in this kitchen? Well, this handy little product is ideal under the sink. It keeps all your cleaning products together and it's portable. It's great. These oak trays are a really nice touch. And they're always to hand when you need them. <laughs> Perfect for breakfast in bed. <laughs> <laughs> I love the images in kitchen brochures and magazines, but my kitchen isn't that big, so how can I achieve a similar style? Take this galley for example. It shows it's easy to condense all the key elements of a stylish, well-planned kitchen, but on a smaller scale. Oh, I like this. I feel very much at the centre of this kitchen. Yes, it's a compact U-shape, meaning everything's to hand, and the split-level worktops to find cooking and eating areas. I've noticed that there's clever use of lighting in this kitchen. Yes both decorative and for helping out with tasks in the kitchen. I know Second Nature don't sell appliances, but could you explain to me the best place to position them? The positioning of your appliances, particularly the fridge, the oven, the hob and the sink, should form an effective working triangle. Thank you, Graham. We've discussed a lot of things. What to think about when planning your own kitchen. Layout, design, lighting, storage, worktops, Browse our website for more ideas, smcollection.co.uk.